Did you know that it took 20 years to plan Queen Elizabeth II's funeral? At the age of 96, Queen Elizabeth II passed away on September 8th. Her funeral is set to occur on Monday the 18th at Westminster Abbey. High profile guests such as Prince Harry, King Charles, and Joe Biden are among the 2,000 individuals on the guest list. The 18th Duke of Norfolk, Edward Fitzalan Howard, has been tasked to orchestrate the funeral. He admitted in an interview that ensuring the funeral goes to plan is pretty scary. When planning the funeral, Edward Fitzalan Howard used the funeral of King George VI as a reference point. However, there are some differences. For example, Prince Philip's funeral occurred at Windsor Castle, but due to the large guest list, this location was altered. Royal funerary music will be played and the Queen will be buried in a traditional lead-lined coffin. After Queen Elizabeth II's coffin is transported to Westminster Abbey, the Archbishop of Canterbury will give a sermon. King Charles III, along with other members of the royal family, will walk behind the coffin as it makes the trek to the funeral service location. At the end of the service, a two-minute period of silence will be held. Queen Elizabeth II will be interred at St. George's Chapel alongside her husband, Prince Philip. What's sentimental about the location in which Queen Elizabeth II's funeral is occurring is that in 1947, she got married to Prince Philip in the same spot. The state funeral is to be funded by the public, expected to cost millions of dollars. Rest in peace, Queen Elizabeth. You will be missed.